Hey, hi, hello, my friends. It's Christy with 4AM Junk Journals. Happy Monday. It is time to do some art before breakfast. And I had such a good time altering our um, Project Life card yesterday, which if you didn't see it, I'll just bring it over here for you guys to see it. Didn't it turn out nice? Um, I had such a good time altering that yesterday that I thought we'd go ahead and we'd do another one today. Um, I am going to try and step away a little bit from the man theme that we've had going on, but um, we still have kind of a, um, a, a awesome theme that I just love. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. Um, so we're going to use this card. We're going to use this paper. We're going to use this paper. We're going to use this playing card. We're going to use one of these labels. I'm not sure which one. We're going to probably use some of these. These are just strips of duct tape um, that we're probably going to use. And then um, we're going to use one of these owls. And right now I'm leaning towards this guy right here. Although I really like this one as well. So it will be, most likely be one of those two. Okay. So that's what we're going to do. So let's get started. I'm so excited. How is your Monday going so far? I know it's extremely early. Um, but that's just the way we roll, right? We are early risers here. Okay. Let's just put it down. I'm not going to say that we're not going to think about it very much, but we're just um, not going to think about it very much. <laughs> um, no, I mean, we are. We're just... Um, we're going to make beautiful art, but we're going to do it quickly. This morning how's that gosh guys it's been so cold in my office the last few days um, my room is always the coldest in the house it doesn't matter what the weather is whether it's cold outside or whether the um, air conditioner is running my craft room office whatever is going to always 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 be the coldest room in the house regardless so I'm kind of feeling the cold in my bones Okay, sorry about that. There's not much point in talking very much while I'm doing that because number one, it's hard to concentrate and number two, um, you can't hear me anyway. That thing is loud on this table. Okay, let's go ahead and trim this. And I'm sure you guys are wondering why I'm just keeping this tape on my fingers. I could take it off and tape it to something while we, until we get to it. But I figure it's just going to be a second before I get to it. So I'm just holding on to it. <clears throat> Wide awake. I'm actually ready for work this morning. I'm ready to go. Um, that's a nice change. Usually I'm like, yeah, I don't want to do it. For some reason, I feel pretty good about work today. Maybe that's a omen. It 
Can an omen, is it an omen if it's a good thing? Or are omens only bad things? Hmm. I'm not sure. I'd have to look that up. And guys, really, I just don't care enough to look it up. Should we do it? Oh, wait a minute. Am I doing it wrong? No, it goes this way, doesn't it? Does it go this way? I think it goes this way. But that looks upside down to me. Maybe it's got to be this way. That looks right side up to me. Okay. So where do we want to put this? Or do we want to tear it some? Maybe we don't want it to be quite that large. We'll cut a piece right here maybe. And then maybe right here. Just like that. Yep, I like it. Okay, we're going to take this card. I think we're going to come off the side just like that. And I'm not going to cut that. I'm going to leave it coming off the side. I think. At least that's my plan so far. put some washi on this. I'm thinking. I'm thinking we might want to put some washi on that. This guy's going to win. This guy wins the lotto for which owl do we want to use. This is the only thing I don't like about the sticker books that you get from Amazon, like the, um, oh, what are they called? The antiquarian sticker books and the others too, because this isn't even from an antiquarian. Um, but what I don't like about them, the only thing I don't like about them is all of this white or I've got one that it's blue, but that doesn't really help either because it's still um, awkward to have it there. So that's the only thing I don't like. Other than that, I adore them. Um, sometimes the stickers aren't the best and you need to use glue. But I think that's pretty much true on any stickers. I mean, even with washi, you can't really trust it. you got to use glue. So even with, well, maybe not with the best washi. Because I do have some that I would never have to use glue with. Usually it's that that has the sticker or that has the backing. You know what I'm talking about? Where you have to peel off the backing off the washi. That's usually the washi that you don't have to worry about. But anyway, all that to say, <laughs> I hate all this white on the stickers. And it's fine. I mean, I can fussy cut it. But dang it, if I wanted to fussy cut everything, why would I have bought stickers? You know who has good stickers? <laughs> Is um, like AliExpress and I assume Timu, although I still haven't received my order. Um, Shine. All of them with their little um, clearback stickers. Those are good stickers. Number one, they stick really well. And they um, don't have all this annoying stuff to cut off. However, so they can be really, really hard to peel the backings off of. Sometimes. Sometimes it can be ridiculously hard. 
just occurred to me I used my new scissors to cut sticky stuff. Ah, why didn't y'all say something? You probably were, weren't you? Let's go ahead and give him some glue. go. I'm liking it. I'm liking it. I'm not liking a list of sticking to me though. He's coming together good. I'm liking him. Let's see here. I want to use one of them. I just don't know which one I want to use. Okay, well, obviously that one's too large. Mm, don't want to use the square ones. I'm liking this one. What does that say? Oh, my eyes are so bad. I don't know what that says. But I kind of like the way it looks. What about this one? The round one? Or I guess it's kind of oval. I really like that one. I kind of wish it didn't say travel on it, but I really like that one. How about this? I could go with that. No. Um, how about this one? Okay, I like that. What do y'all think? I like that. Let's peel it off. Speaking of AliExpress and their stickers. And what I was saying about it can be really difficult to peel them. Especially when you have no fingernails, and I have no fingernails. Okay. I'm not going to cut the card, but I am going to cut the sticker. If that makes sense. Probably not. Y'all probably going, why? Why would you? And there is a reason. You guys might not even be questioning it because you probably know. The reason is because that sticker will stick to everything. Whereas the card will just hang out there. Okay. But I don't like the way that looks. So guess what? I'm trimming the card because I don't like the way that looks. It's all going to have to be even. That's not bad. It's okay. I can probably live with that. Okay. I feel like it needs some washi. Let's get it some washi. Um, let's get it. To go with some dark floral. I don't feel like that matches. Okay, so how about.
Definitely not. What colors are we looking at? Mm. Here. Ooh, this one would be nice. This is some Tim Holtz washi, so it's some of my better washi. Still sometimes needs some extra sticking help, but as washi goes, it's not as good as that washi that you peel off the back, though. Yeah, I like that. Don't you guys think that kind of finishes it off nice? Okay, let's flip her over, and we need to cover the back, especially since I did it upside down. Um, let's cover the back with something. Let's go ahead and just cover it. We could cover that whole thing with that paper right there. Now, you say, that does not leave any room for journaling. No, it doesn't. But I'm going to do the same thing I did on the other one, and I'm going to gesso it so that there is room for journaling. So if you guys didn't see that video yesterday, be sure and check that out. Um, because in my art before breakfast yesterday morning, we did the same thing. We gessoed the back. <clears throat> I feel like I'm losing my voice. That'll make for a fun day at work. know what I've got. Oh, I don't have my calendar in here. I was going to say, I don't know what I've got going on at work today as far as resident activities, if I need my voice or not. I know they have bingo. Um, so I won't need my voice for that because I'm not calling the bingo. I can't remember what else. I'm hoping today I'll hear from the school um, about my request to have students come and read poetry to them tomorrow for National Poetry Day and also about my request to have them um, come and do our bulletin boards. Oh, which reminds me, I don't think I told y'all, when I was at the thrift shop on Saturday morning, um, I found these really adorable, like, bunny plaques that have the little bunnies poking off of them. And they're so cute, and I bought them for our bulletin board at work for, like, $3 a piece, and they were wooden plaques, so I can use them year after year after year. But they were super, super cute. I'm excited about those. Okay, yep, yeah, I like that. And I don't think it needs anything more than that. I think just that with some gesso over it and some ink around the edges. And this will be good to go. Now if I really wanted to, I could add on like maybe something like that. Which actually isn't bad at all. But it would take up so much of my journal space that I'm not going to do it. I am going to go ahead and gesso it. And then we're going to ink it. I'm going to keep this fairly light. It dries faster if it's light. And it doesn't need to be particularly dark. We're not trying to cover anything up. We're just trying to make a journaling spot. Just need a good place to write. I was trying to cover something up that would be different like if I if there was something I didn't like or I had made a happy little tree aka mistake <clears throat> that would be different I'm gonna have gesso all over my hands that's all right they'll wash and I still have to get my shower before work so Alrighty, there we go. I'm going to lay it down. I know it's going to stick because it's still wet. 
I'm okay with that. I'm going to lay it down there. I'll pull it back up here in a second. Um, let's go. Oh, I know. You guys are going to be so shocked. So shocked that we're going to do some vintage photo. But we're actually going to do abandoned coral this morning, too. So let's go vintage photo and give it a base coat. I usually like to start with a base coat of vintage photo. Go ahead and use the abandoned coral next. Let's see if we like that. Oh yeah, okay. Yeah. Okay. I can live with that. Cool. Uh, then we're going to go in with a frayed burlap. Oh, yes, that's beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Look how pretty that is. This is the way to start your morning. Gosh, that's gorgeous. All right, I'm loving it. Let's bring in some hickory smoke. I don't feel like it needs much in the way of the, dish, of the um, vintage photo, but I'm going to put a little in this corner, and I'm going to put a little in this corner. Oh gosh, guys, that's so pretty. Isn't that beautiful? I'm loving it, loving it, loving it. Okay, let's flip it over, and I'm going to do this back side real quick. Barely touching this with this abandoned coral. I don't want much. Just a little touch of the color. I'm going to take the frayed burlap, but I'm only going to go around the edge. So, in other words, I'm only going to go... Like this. I'm not going to go into that center part. And I'm going to hit it with the hickory smoke from the inside out. So I'm going to start with a circle of it in the inside and just work my way out in bigger and bigger and bigger circles. I'm going to do it again, starting in the middle and working my way out. I like it. Thank you. 
grease them up one more time. Yep, I like it. Okay. I forgot to do this yesterday, but I'm going to be sure and do it today. Use my one of a kind creation stamp. I guess it was still a little bit wet with the gesso, but that's okay. Let's turn it over and take a look. I'm really liking it. I think it's so pretty. There is our art before breakfast for Monday morning. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed it. I hope you found it useful or at the very least entertaining. I hope that you crafted along and I hope that you'll come back and join me again for another video very soon. If you like what you saw today, please give me a big thumbs up. If you'd like to see more from this channel, hit that subscribe button. And if you click the little bell, it will notify you every time I upload a new video. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you think. Let me know what you're going to be crafting today. And I will talk with all of you again soon. Bye.